Welcome back to The Real Deal, and today I'm gonna to tell you how to avoid the rental trap in 2022. Are you one of the many renters thinking about where you'll live the next time your lease is up? Before you decide whether to look for a new house or another apartment, it's important to understand the true costs of renting in 2022. As a renter, you should know rents have been rising since 1988. In 2021, rents grew dramatically, according to apartmentlist.com. Since January 2021, quote, the national median rent has increased by staggering 17.8%. To put that in context, rent growth from January to November averaged just 2.6% in the pre-pandemic years of 2017 to 2019. That increase in 2021 was far greater than the typical rent increases we've seen in recent years. In other words, rents are rising fast and the 2022 national housing forecast from realtor.com projects prices for vacant units will continue to increase this year. Quote, in 2022, we expect this trend will continue and fuel rent growth. At a national level, we forecast rent growth of 7.1% in the next 12 months somewhat ahead of home price growth. That means if you're planning to move into a different rental this year, you'll likely pay far more than you have in years past. Home ownership provides an alternative to rising rents. If you're a renter facing rising rental costs, you might wonder what alternatives you have. If so, consider home ownership. One of the many benefits of home ownership is it provides a stable monthly cost you can lock in for the duration of the loan. As Lawrence Young, chief economist at the National Association of Realtors says, quote, fast rising rents and increasing consumer prices may have some prospective buyers seeking the protection of a fixed, consistent mortgage payment. If you're planning to make a move this year, locking in your monthly housing costs for the next 15 to 30 years can be a major benefit. You'll avoid wondering if you'll need to adjust your budget to account for annual increases. Homeowners also enjoy the added benefit of home equity, which has grown substantially right now. In fact, the latest Homeowner Equity Insight report from CoreLogic shows the average homeowner gained a whopping $56,700 in equity over the last 12 months. As a renter, your payment only covers the cost of your dwelling. When you pay your mortgage, you grow your wealth through four savings. That is your home equity. Ladies and gents, here's the bottom line. If you're thinking of renting this year, it's important to keep in mind the true costs you'll face. So let's get together so you can see how you can begin your journey to home ownership today. That's all we've got time for on this episode of The Real Deal. So if you're a renter and you're thinking of buying and you also really like my content, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. It'll mean the world to me, and we'll see you next week.